Hey there, Donna with Photonic Health. Today I wanted to chat with you about EEE, which is also equine eastern encephalitis. This potentially deadly virus enters through the horse's bloodstream via mosquitoes, and it is pretty devastating and can be pretty devastating. And the reason for that is while Western medicine has come out with a vaccination that can help prevent it and minimize the effects of it, it does not have a cure on the back end for those horses if they were to contract this. And so I wanted to chat with you today because we have a 100% success rate with EEE. We've been, um, I'm gonna say fortunate, unfortunately. Um, back in 2010, one of my geldings came down with EEE and it hit pretty, pretty darn fast. Um, fortunately, we knew what the symptoms were. Um, he had ataxia, which means he loses, he lost all coordination of his limbs. Like literally I could take his back leg, cross it underneath his body and he literally would have kept it there for a half an hour. And a horse with normal responses would pull it back, you know, within a minute. Um, one of the other things was he became very, very listless, almost like he had depression. He wasn't interested in eating. He just wanted to stand around. And I just knew that something wasn't right. Um, at that time, they didn't even have vaccinations for that, so at least we're making advances in that uh, department. But what we did instead was we utilized red light therapy um, at a very specific wavelength, and we illuminated his carotid artery, and we also applied lights to antiviral points, acupuncture points, very uh, specific to help boost the immune system. And within three days, our horse was completely out of it. He was being treated, I shouldn't say treated, he was being seen by a veterinarian. And my veterinarian had drawn, came, examined him, drew blood. He called me five days later with the results of it and saying, how's your horse doing? I go, he's fine. And the doctor goes, what do you mean he's fine? I go, he, he's fine. Like he's back to normal. He goes, I don't know how you did that, but he has equine Eastern encephalitis and it has a 90% mortality rate. And he said, so whatever you're doing, keep doing it. And since then, um, our company offers these antiviral points free of charge to anybody. And especially if you're dealing with a uh, animal that has Eastern encephalitis, that has West Nile virus, um, we want to try to save as many animals as possible. So if you are in fact dealing with this, which I hope you're not, but if you are dealing with this, please reach out to us. We are happy to share um, these points with you and to guide you through this journey um, at no cost. We, we just want everybody to be happy and healthy. So Keep an eye on your horse, especially during mosquito season, and know what their normal, normal um, everyday habits are. And if you see anything that's starting to go a little haywire that's out of the norm, you wanna, you wanna get, get a head start of it before it becomes too late. So whichever side the hyoid was out, in this case, hers seems to be off to the right side. That's where you're gonna take and put your pro light on high and put your standard light on low. Now again, if you don't have two lights, you're just gonna put your hand on the opposite side. So I always put the low light on first, and then put the standard light, or high light on the other side second. Put your hands against the horse, and look in the same direction that she 